What's up, everyone? Welcome to Power Play with CJ to focus in on the Chicago Blackhawks acquiring David Runeblad, uh, defenseman from the Phoenix Coyotes, and why I think it's a big deal for Chicago. Runeblad had has a lot of offensive upside. I believe he's only 23 years old, and um, you know I did a piece on him two and a half years ago in the Power Play. Was first starting out. And uh, I like his offensive game. I think he's got. A, he gives a great home run pass. He reminds me a lot of uh, current Chicago Blackhawks farmhand Adam Clendenning, and uh, you know, fan of the show, fan of the power play, by the way, Quinny. And I uh, Runeblad's got nine points in fifty NHL games. He's traveling around a bit. He's a first round pick of the, excuse me, uh, St. Louis Blues back in two thousand nine. Got shipped to. Ottawa for a first round pick, turned out to be Tarasenko, and then got shipped to Phoenix in the uh, Kyle Turris trade. His numbers this year one assist in 12 games with the Coyotes, four assists in six games with Portland in the AHL. Again, still only 23 years old, still has some growing to do. Six foot two, 200 pounds, not a bad defense, not a bad size kid for defenseman. Uh, I think Chicago may have completely pillaged them on this deal because he's still young, he's still growing. Last year he had 50, 39 points in 50 AHL games. That's awesome for a defenseman. So you got to look at it as Chicago got a young player that can move the puck and facilitate, you know, the offense. And I think Chicago's calling him up to the NHL right away. He's going to play. He's played 50 games on the show, so. But this is the fourth organization he's been in. And, uh, you know, I'm not going to say make or break time for him, but I'm impressed that the Chicago Blackhawks are giving him a look at the NHL level right away. And, um, you know, so, talking about Clendenning and a couple of the other guys, maybe a few guys from the organization are on the move now. I don't know. You know, Paul, I mean, you look at they moved Olsen, maybe they're going to, you know, they move Perry and Olsen as well as Jimmy Hayes, a lot of their farm hands that have been around for a while. So maybe they're, you know, trying to bring in external players to bulk up, bulk up their farm system. I don't know. But, uh, you know, good to see a team like that get a, get a young player. That um, that still has some upside and can um, can help the team. You know, maybe not right away, but you know, obviously play right away, but definitely achieve uh, what he can do uh, down the line. Again, I like Rumblad's game. I know he's been inconsistent at the NHL level, but you know, I think if given a chance, he could be a, a very productive National Hockey League player. His offensive instincts are awesome. It's just um, you know the defensive game, a few other things that have held him back. But I'm curious to see what he can do. I mean, in fairness to Chicago, I think it was like a second and a fourth maybe. Take a chance on a guy like that. Take a chance on a guy that was once a 17th pick in the draft. 17th. 1-7. Anyway, that's on this episode of the Power Play with CJ on uh, the Chicago Blackhawks acquiring David Rumblad from the Phoenix Coyotes. Stay tuned for episodes for the season and beyond. Later, guys.